So over here you can see that I have some videos on my timeline and what you can also do is place out an audio on the timeline so that um, you can play the audio and video together. So here you can see that I have already imported out some mp3 audios and if I want them on the timeline I can go around over here and click and drag it out on the timeline right here. But once I do that here, you can see that it actually stays on the video layer itself. So just like this, you can see that it is on the video layer. So if I were to uh, go around and right click over here, I can go around onto the track operations and click on add audio track. So I have another audio track right here. So I can go around and click and drag around the audio right here, as you can see. And I can go around and set the audio to certain range. So over here, you can see that the audio in this range. So now if I were to go around and split at playhead, you can see that the audio has been divided into two. So I can go around and delete this and you can see that the audio layer is beneath. So if I were to go around and press the play button right here, then you will be able to hear out the audio that I added in. That is the Stacy and George audio right here and the video um, uh, over here at the same time. So if I were to press the play button, then this is what you hear. So audio does stutter a bit and the video does stutter because, uh, because uh, it has not been processed yet. So once that is processed, then um, uh, that won't be a problem anymore. So that is how you can place out audio inside of timeline in shortcut. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.